dear students today we will see sixth chapter that is more on logo logo is a computer language that is used to make various shapes write text and perform calculations like your paint but in paint by using mouse we will draw some images but using commands we can draw images using logo it is one type of programming language we have seen in the last class that is in the previous year in the third standard about logo little bit but now we will see more on logo here there are some commands one is pr command that is called print primitive command this print primitive command is to display some messages if i say pr computer that is print computer then the output will be displayed and on the logo you can see in the logo screen there is one triangle shape that is called turtle that component is called turtle and turtle moves on main screen according to the commands what we are giving if i take pr command then how it will take we can see pr is one type of mathematical functions you can make some difference product quotient and remainder by using pr command how we can do that one just see the command pr we will take pr in the beginning then sum 7 space 9 then it displays the result as 16 that is nothing but 7 plus 9 pr sum that is pr in the bracket sum 10 15 20 40 so it displays the result as 85 pr difference 20 space 6 then it displays 14 that is difference 20 minus 6 in the same way we can find the product by using pr product 15 space 2 that is 15 into 2 it displays the result as 30 so in this way we can find out the quotient that is when we divide we will get the quotient at the top same way pr quotient 50 space 10 that is 10 phi ja 50 so we will get the result as phi quotient phi same way we can take the remainder or modulus pr remainder 8 space phi that is Phi one ja phi. We will get the remainder as three. So eight. When we divide it by phi, we will get the remainder as three. Okay. In this way, we can display the result by using PR command. There is one more called set PC primitive. That set PC primitive is to change the color. we can set the pen color using set pc primitive it is used to change the color of turtle pen this primitive is used with a number code that represents the color of turtle's pen that is 0 for black 1 for blue in the same way 6 for yellow 7 white then 8 brown that is up to 15 there are different colors in screen you can see that is how we can take the command set pc space 6 fd 50 then using the color code 6 that is yellow color it will draw yellow color line of 50 steps that is fd in the forward direction it will draw 50 color line that is one line of 50 steps 
एस ई टी एच प्रिमिटिव इज लाइक आर टी कमांड ओके एंड दिस एग्जाम्पल वी कैन सी सेट एच थर्टी द टर्टल विल टर्न बाय थर्टी डिग्री एंगल इन क्लॉक वाइज डायरेक्शन फ्रॉम इट होम पोजिशन ओके एस ई टी एच नाइंटी देन टर्टल विल मूव नाइंटी डिग्री राइट ओके देन रिपीट प्रिमिटिव इज यूज टू रिपीट अ टास्क बाय एनी नंबर ऑफ टाइम्स इट रेड्यूजेस लॉट ऑफ एफर्ट्स फॉर राइटिंग स्टेटमेंट्स मेनी टाइम्स ड्यू टू द रिपीटेटिव टास्क when you use the repeat primitive like for example fd 70 rt 90 that is forward 70 points then right side 90 points repeat this process four times then automatically it will draw one rectangle so repeat four fd 70 right 90 again fd 70 right 90 so four times it will make the same actions by that we can draw one rectangle okay we can see a square will be created with this command ms excel that is seventh chapter ms excel is a spreadsheet software it is along with microsoft office as you know Microsoft Office contains Word, Excel, and PowerPoint, and Excel is another software which is in the MS Office, and it is called one type of spreadsheet. Spreadsheet means sheet with rows and columns. That we will call it as a spreadsheet. It contains many number of sheets, and it is useful to make bigger. calculations just like how we will do the calculations using calculator same way big number of calculations we can make by using ms excel we can see uses of ms excel we can arrange the data in a systematic way we can calculate the numeric data we can arrange the data that is sort in ascending and descending order we can generate series of data that is just like serial numbers multiplication table easily we can generate by using excel we can filter the data with that means we can search one specific data using excel how we can start ms excel to start ms excel click on start button then all programs then ms office and then ms office excel or even in the search button we can type excel and we can press enter components of ms excel window on screen we can see it will show the components different components at the top there is office button then there is a quick access toolbar then title bar then toolbar ribbons then cell pointer then formula bar then columns then rows that is numbers from 1 2 3 4 and then the rows and column area we will call it as a worksheet how we can enter data in excel when we see the cell pointer in this cell pointer we directly we can type text or number or date then automatically it will take the data and it displays on the screen now we will see how we can create a new workbook in excel click on the office button that is round button at the top click on it then it will show the new option and then select the new workbook that is blank and recent 
option from the templates pane then click on blank workbook then click on the create button to create a new workbook calculating data when we are typing numbers or any numerical data we can calculate by using equal to symbol maybe for example if i take equal to 10 plus 20 it displays the result as 30 so in the same way we can type the data in excel sheet maybe in b2 b3 b4 b5 b6 then we can make or we can take equal to b2 plus b3 plus b4 plus b5 plus b6 and we can press enter key to display the result same way we can find out some other work maybe for example you want to find out the difference then equal to e2 minus d2 that is e2 value minus d2 value it will show the difference then saving a workbook how we can save workbook again the same method click on office button then save as option then in the save as dialog box type the name that is file name and click on the save button to save the file how we can delete a worksheet if the worksheet is available in excel workbook by default it shows three worksheets sheet 1 sheet 2 sheet 3 right click on any worksheet and select delete option to delete a worksheet okay then there is a progress to test your work just work on it thank you students your miss will give more information or some questions on these topics